Welcome to Variantica, where science isn't settled and reality isn't what it seems. What if the laws of physics are just the beginning? From forgotten experiments to theories that challenge everything, we explore the mysteries science can't explain. Yet, truth hides in the unknown. Are you ready to question everything? Step into the unexplained. Step into Variantica. Imagine the heart of an atom, the nucleus. Often we picture it as a neat, round ball a perfect sphere nestled at the center. And for many atoms, that's a pretty good starting point. Think of those nuclei with special numbers of protons or neutrons, what we call magic numbers, like 2, 8, 20, 28, 50, 82, or 126. These nuclei are particularly stable, their internal arrangements leading to a beautifully symmetrical, spherical form. It's like they have achieved a perfect balance a harmonious arrangement within their tiny world. But as we explore further, we discover that the nuclear world isn't always perfectly round. Many nuclei take on slightly different forms, and one of the most common is the ellipsoid. Picture taking that perfect sphere and gently stretching it out along one axis, like squeezing a ball to make it longer. This elongated shape, like a rugby ball, is what we call prolate. Now imagine taking that same sphere and instead of stretching it, you flatten it, like pressing down on a ball to make it wider and thinner. This flattened disc-like shape is another type of ellipsoid, known as oblate. Think of a spinning top that's been squashed a little. That's an oblate nucleus. But the complexity doesn't stop there. Some nuclei are even more intricate, exhibiting what we call a triaxial shape. Imagine a shape with three axes of different lengths. It's no longer a simple stretch or flattening, but a more lopsided, three-dimensional irregularity. And in some fascinating cases, particularly with certain unstable nuclei, we even encounter pear-shaped nuclei. This asymmetry, this bulge on one side, is linked to some very fundamental aspects of physics, hinting at subtle imbalances within the nuclear structure. So, what dictates these fascinating variations in nuclear shape? Well, it's a delicate dance of forces and the arrangement of the nucleus's building blocks, the protons and neutrons, collectively known as nucleons. The strong nuclear force acts like a superglue binding these nucleons together, while the electromagnetic force pushes the positively charged protons apart. The interplay of these opposing forces can lead to these beautiful deformations from a perfect sphere. Furthermore, just like electrons in an atom occupy specific energy levels, or shells, so too do the nucleons within the nucleus. The way these nuclear shells fill up and the interactions between the nucleons in these shells significantly influence the overall shape. Think of it like building with blocks. Certain arrangements are more stable and symmetrical than others. To understand and predict these shapes, scientists use various theoretical models. The liquid drop model offers a more classical picture, imagining the nucleus as a droplet of fluid where surface tension favors a spherical shape, but other forces can cause it to deform. On the other hand, the nuclear shell model delves into the quantum mechanical world, considering the energy levels and arrangements of individual nucleons. Why does all this matter? Well, the shape of the nucleus has profound implications. It affects the stability of the atom, influencing whether it's likely to decay or remain intact. It plays a crucial role in nuclear reactions, determining how nuclei interact with each other. The unique shapes also leave their fingerprints on the energy levels and radiation emitted by the nucleus, which we can study through spectroscopy. And in the grand cosmic scheme, Understanding nuclear shapes is even vital for unraveling how the heaviest elements in the universe were forged in the hearts of stars and during cataclysmic events. So the next time you picture an atom, remember that its heart, the nucleus, isn't always a simple sphere. It can be a dynamic, multifaceted entity, its shape a testament to the intricate and fascinating world within the atom. If it is helpful for you, please like, share, and subscribe, and press the bell icon button for my latest update.